Hello, Econ students. It's Dr. Daniel. You can see that once again, I still am sitting down because I cannot stand up and I can't write on a whiteboard. I hope that by next year, I'll be doing both. Um, today, I want to talk to you about the Federal Reserve and why you should care what the Federal Reserve does. The Federal Reserve controls the money supply of the United States of America. And when you control the money supply, you control interest, interest rates and vice versa. So the Federal Reserve has since 2010 been allowing mass quantities of money into the United States economy to keep interest rates extremely low. So between 2010 and 2021, mortgage interest rates stayed below 5% for that entire time. There's no other 10-year period in our nation's history in the last 40 years where that was true. That is a real anomaly. Those were artificially low interest rates and they were uh, created by a constantly increasing money supply. Well, as the Nobel Prize winning economist Milton Friedman said almost 100 years ago, inflation is always and everywhere a monetary phenomenon. What does that mean? Inflation is always caused by printing too much money, which the United States has been doing. So <clears throat> what do you do when your country develops inflation as the United States did starting in 2022? Well, the only way to combat inflation is to raise interest rates. What do they have to do with each other and how do raising interest rates fight inflation? Well, interest rates factor into the cost of buying homes, buying cars, and buying big ticket items, large consumer products for many people. So when interest rates rise, it makes it harder and harder for people to spend money on items like homes or cars. Therefore, they spend less. And when people spend less, prices stop rising as quickly. So, for example, in January of 2021, the interest rate for a 30-year fixed rate mortgage was 2.9% in the first quarter of 2021. 2.9%. By 2023, it had more than doubled to six and a half percent. Today, this week, the 30-year fixed rate mortgage is at 7.1 percent. The Federal Reserve had said in December and again in March that they were going to be cutting interest rates two or three times in 2024. That's not going to happen because inflation is still too much of a problem. So you need to pay attention to what the Federal Reserve says they're going to do and what they actually do and what it means in your life. See you next time.